peek at what's going on out there right now for us. Uh, we've got a sunrise time, which happens a little bit closer to uh, the 7 o'clock hour now. or at 6.50. Sunset is at 7.05, so we've got more than 12 hours of daylight. Uh, we basically have another three hours to go, though, until we peak around the uh, summer solstice. So it's going to get even better, guys, with time. Temperatures will certainly get better because it's crisp out there to start this morning. We're only in the 20s out there for everybody. Radar picture for us is nice and dry, but as I mentioned, we've really started to see some very heavy activity overnight for pretty much all of the state of California. There's an atmospheric river of moisture, which they've managed to tap into with this weather system, and it's just pummeling the rain on shore. They'll be in tap with that uh, probably through the weekend, which will mean upwards of 10 inches of rain for mountainous areas of California. And again, that could present issues in the east. Yep, it's the four Easter guys. They've got over 14 inches of snow already on Long Island and could potentially add to that as it's still coming down out there. Boston still getting snow. Bangor, Maine still getting snow. It's not over yet. It will likely wrap up a little bit later on today. For us, we do have some rain and snow headed in our direction, but it doesn't really get here. You can see until overnight Friday into Saturday. Most of it stays to our south and west. It's going to graze us, sort of, but most of it stays kind of out of our area. Um, where we do have the snow, though, accumulation could happen, but it's probably going to melt pretty quickly. For today, 48 degrees, sunshine, and a tad warmer out there. Seven day planner shows that next week temperatures do get uh, back up to right about where they should be, Derek. That's upper 40s. 50s, but Saturday is the most winter like day of the next week.